If you really want to learn how to use Taba app in English language or you want to see how you can quickly translate Taba app from Chinese to English language, consider to watch this video because I'm going to show you step by step on how you can use Taba app in English language without any stress, okay? So let's get started. But before we dive deep into tutorial, as you know me, my name is Rafi Yakub. I'm a procurement and importation coach. If you want to contact me for importation business, you can contact me on WhatsApp via the number in the description of this video. And also remember to subscribe to this channel for more tutorial about importation business. So with that being said, so let's dive into tutorial and see how you can quickly translate or how you can use Tower Hub in English language. So let's get started. So the first thing you want to do is to head over to your Play Store. So if you are using Android phone, what you need to do is to head over to your Google Play Store. So right here, I'm going to click on Play Store. On getting to your Google Play Store, what you need to do is to make use of search engine at the top right here. So what you need to type in right here is an application called iDictionary. So you need to i dictionary then you click on search so you can see the name of the app right here i dictionary and then you can see the app icon so what you need to do is to click on here to install the app so this app here is what we are going to use to translate from chinese to english language on Taiwa. so i'm going to click on here to install the app straight up after you successful download and install the High Dictionary app, what you need to do next is to click on Enable right here. After click on Enable, next thing you need to do is to click on Open. So it's going to load up like this. So the next thing you need to do is to click on Open right here. Then click on Allow Display. Once you've done that, then you click on go back. So it's take you right here. So the next thing you need to do is to click on look up right here. Have you click on look up, it's going to take you right here. So what you need to do is to make sure that this is on. But in case if it is not on, just tap on this button right here. It's going to be on. And then if you want to off it, just tap on here to off it also. If I tap now, you see it has been off. And if I come back here, I tap it again, it should be automatically on. So this is most important needs to be on if you want to use it on the Tauber app. So if you are done using it, just come back here and turn it off. This is how this app it works. All right, the next thing is to go ahead and use this app on our Tauber app. So immediately, you need to take note of one thing. Immediately, this is on, then you are going to see uh, the app. It's going to be one side of your phone. It can be on any any side on the screen of your phone. So you have to take note of that. So now let's head over to our Taobao and see how you can use this app to translate from Chinese to English. Uh, there are two ways by which you can use to use this particular app. Okay. One of the first way is that you can look for the icon on your so this is going to pump up so once this thing is pump up the next thing you want to do is to make sure you click on global translation so in sometimes it may ask you to accept the terms of user just make sure you click on accept then have you click on accept to take you back here then you tap on anywhere outside of the screen then at this point here you have to give a permission then you have to locate i dictionary off then make sure you turn it on and then you give an allow boom so you are done then you can go back to your Taoba app the second way by which you can use this app it is to drag the app icon to the message like this and it's going to translate to the english language so let's scroll down and take it to the products link so let's say for instance we want to know the product this product name right here so we want to know this product name you can see this is written in in chinese and we want to know the name in english or better still we can uh let's for instance we want to know the product name of this product 
So we have to take the icon from here and uh, we take it to the Chinese and it will automatically convert it to English language. So you can read what the right right, right here is home message here. Anytime one press relax message convertible and convenient. So you can see the name of the product right here. Now you want to go further, you have to you can click on the product link. So when you click on the product link and you can easily scroll down and uh, use the same i dictionary to translate from Chinese to English. So let's for instance we want to we want to see what is written right here in English language. So I will just drag this icon here. So once you drag the icon here, it automatically converts it. So you can see this simply means integrated express delivery can be used directly. The first online purchase of big item, message effect very good, easy tire, whole family like how to message, although the price is low, very happy, do the work fine, pretty. So this is how you can just read it in English language, simple as that. And one more thing you can do with this uh, icon right here, with this uh, translation app. So you can also tap on the app again. When you tap on the app, this is going to pop up and this button move right here, it allow you to move the icon to another section. Okay. So another great thing about this hub is that if you click on here again, so you can see different options right here. We have grammar, we have home. This allows you to go back home to the, uh, to the hub. And then the language section has to do with the number of country language that you can find on this hub. And the globalization, if I click on globalization, this allows you to translate. You can see it scan the whole page. And once it's completed scan the whole page, it will automatically convert so after a successful scan the whole page, you can see everything right here will be translated into English language, thereby you'll be able to read what is written on this page. So this is how you can use your Taobao app in English language step-by-step -step tutorial if you are using Android phone. I hope you really find this video useful. If you enjoyed this video, give this video a big like and also remember to subscribe to this channel for more tutorial about importation business. If you want to contact me for importation business, you can contact me on WhatsApp via the number in the description of this video. Thank you very much for watching this video from the beginning to the end and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye for now.